We were distributed to rebel commanders as objects without rights and were sexually abused. Mama Babu, Bua Keti Bari, Ma Kam Gorsu Kunai Orko Rosgar Tiana Mo Irak Ma Kam Manop Toskorgo Toskor Boego Manisu. How many more 13 year old girls, your daughter, my sister? Our children need to be forced into prostitution. During its 14th session in June, the Human Rights Council heard testimonies from four people trafficking victims. It was made aware of the necessity to protect journalists in armed conflict, to empower women through education, and to the effects of toxic and dangerous wastes on the enjoyment of human rights. Measures to be taken to prevent pregnancy-related deaths, injuries and disabilities were also discussed. Today, I am also registering my shock at the report that humanitarian aid was met with violence early this morning, reportedly causing death and injury as the boat convoy approached the Gaza coast. Following the Israeli raid on the humanitarian flotilla to Gaza, the Human Rights Council decided to hold an urgent debate and to adopt a resolution. The resolution decides to authorize the President to appoint an independent international fact-finding mission to investigate violations of international law, including international humanitarian and human rights law, resulting from this Israeli attack. Draft Resolution L1, as already revised, is therefore adopted. Migrants' rights, summary executions, freedom of expression, extreme poverty and the situation in Haiti six months after the earthquake were also on the programme of work of the Human Rights Council. Altogether, 18 special rapporteurs and independent experts shared their reports and exchanged views with the Council and urged it to take action. We also insist on the necessity for any allegations of secret detention and extraordinary rendition to be promptly investigated. Reports on the human rights situation of 16 countries submitted to the Universal Periodic Review were endorsed by the Council. Eight new independent experts were appointed and 16 resolutions and three decisions were adopted, most of them by consensus. The Council decided to reinforce its technical cooperation with the Kyrgyz Republic to proclaim the 24th of March as the International Day for the Right to the Truth to accelerate efforts to eliminate all forms of violence against women and to address attacks on school children in Afghanistan. Four years after its creation, the Human Rights Council continues to dedicate itself to its overall objective to protect and promote all human rights and fundamental freedoms, to make this world a better world for everyone, everywhere.